Have you ever felt like you were facing a dead-end situation where everything seems to go wrong and solutions are out of reach? Perhaps you've tried everything, yet nothing has changed. Now is the time to pause, take a deep breath, and remember that God can fix what is broken. No matter the size of the challenge or the severity of the problem, He is greater than any obstacle. It's time to trust in God, surrender your worries, and wait for the breakthrough He is preparing. When we face challenges in life, whether in our personal lives, at work, or in our relationships, we often find ourselves unsure of what to do. It is in these moments that we need divine intervention, asking God to mend what is broken and guide us toward progress. Whether it's financial issues, emotional struggles, or spiritual battles, prayer is the means through which we can tap into God's power to transform any situation. He is the God who repairs, restores, and brings new opportunities, and today is the day to place your full trust in Him. Prayer is a powerful tool for reaching God's blessings. Sometimes we may feel stuck, as if we are facing an insurmountable wall, but God is the God of breakthroughs. He is the one who helps us overcome obstacles and grants us victory over adversities. By handing our concerns over to Him and praying with faith, we open the doors for the impossible to happen. God not only hears us, but also acts in response to our prayers. You might be wondering when you will see the breakthrough you have been praying for. At times, it may seem like God is taking His time, but that doesn't mean He isn't working. When we pray persistently, we demonstrate our trust that He is faithful and just to bring us victory in His perfect timing. No matter how great your need or how complicated the situation may seem, God can repair and bring blessings beyond what you can imagine. He is already preparing the way for the breakthrough you need. As we pray, remember that God's blessings are not just material. He blesses us with peace, wisdom, strength and joy, even amidst the toughest circumstances. Sometimes, the greatest breakthrough we can experience is the transformation of our hearts and minds, learning to trust God more and rely less on our own strength. As you pray, ask God to renew your faith, give you the courage to move forward and trust that He is fixing everything in due time. Today, as you lift your prayers, place everything in God's hands. Set aside worries and anxiety and fully trust that He is working in your life to bring about the breakthrough you need. The Lord is faithful to fulfill His promises and repair what is broken. He is the God of blessings and breakthroughs, and as you persist in prayer, know that He is acting powerfully. Prepare your heart to receive the answers that will come in God's perfect timing. When we face situations that seem impossible to resolve, our first instinct is often to try to solve everything on our own. We seek immediate solutions, become anxious, and let worry dominate our thoughts. However, God calls us to surrender these matters to Him and trust in His power to mend what is broken. A clear example of this is the story of Moses and the people of Israel standing before the Red Sea. They were surrounded by enemies with no path ahead and panic took over. But instead of succumbing to fear, Moses cried out to God, the Lord opened the sea, creating a pathway where there was none. This teaches us that even when we don't see a solution before us, God is capable of making the impossible happen. The secret lies in trusting, praying, and waiting for the right moment to move forward. Another example that teaches us to trust God to bring breakthroughs and mend our situations is the story of Hannah. Hannah was barren, and for many years, she carried the weight of sadness and shame for not being able to have children. In the midst of her pain, she did not give up on seeking God. She went to the temple and fervently prayed, pouring her heart out to the Lord. Her prayer was heard, and God granted her the son she so desired, Samuel. 
This story shows us that even when we feel our prayers are unanswered or that we have been waiting for a long time, God hears every cry. He can bring blessings and breakthroughs in the most painful areas of our lives, as long as we do not give up on praying and trusting Him. Often, the greatest progress we experience comes through persistence and patience while God works in His timing. In our finances, we also face storms that seem insurmountable. We may feel overwhelmed by debts or unable to provide enough for our needs and those of our families. In the Bible, we see the story of a widow of one of Elisha's disciples who was about to lose her children as payment for her debts. She had nowhere else to turn but to seek divine help. Elisha told her to gather as many vessels as she could and fill them with the little oil she had. Miraculously, the oil did not run out until all the vessels were full, allowing her to sell the oil and pay off her debts. This teaches us that no matter how limited we feel in our circumstances, God can multiply what we have when we trust in Him. He not only sustains us, but also leads us to experience financial breakthroughs we never thought possible. Broken relationships can be one of the most painful storms we face. The lack of reconciliation, deep wounds, and distrust can create barriers that seem insurmountable. In the story of Joseph, we see a powerful example of how God can restore relationships that appear irreparable. Betrayed by his own brothers and sold into slavery, Joseph spent years away from his family. Nevertheless, he maintained his faith in God. When his brothers came to him during a famine, Joseph had the opportunity to take revenge, but he chose the path of reconciliation. He forgave his brothers and in doing so, restored his family. Joseph's example teaches us that, instead of holding on to grudges or waiting for others to come to us, we can seek reconciliation and trust that God will bring healing and restoration to our relationships. Sometimes, the advancement we need lies in the forgiveness we offer. We also cannot forget about internal storms, the conflicts and struggles we face within ourselves, fear, anxiety, and a lack of peace can hinder our progress. A powerful biblical example is the transformation of Saul into Paul. Before his encounter with Jesus, Saul was a fierce persecutor of Christians, filled with hatred and violence. However, after his encounter with Christ, he underwent a complete transformation. God fixed what was broken inside Saul, and he became Paul, one of the greatest apostles in Christian history. This shows us that no matter how far we may feel from God or how broken we may be on the inside, He can transform us. God can bring advancement in our spiritual lives, healing our inner wounds and empowering us to be used for great purposes. These stories illustrate that in all areas of life, whether in external or internal crises, God is present ready to mend what is broken and bring advancements that we often cannot even imagine. The secret lies in trusting Him, surrendering our worries, and believing that He can transform any situation, no matter how challenging it may seem. When we stop trying to fix everything on our own and pray in faith, God acts, bringing solutions that go beyond our understanding and guiding us on a path of blessings and victory. Now that we have reflected on how God can repair any situation and bring breakthroughs in the most difficult areas of our lives, it is time to prepare for prayer. This is the moment to open our hearts and surrender to Him all our concerns, knowing that He is powerful enough to act where we see no solution. Trust in God's power, which is already at work in every detail, and allow His peace to fill your heart as we draw near to Him in prayer. Let us pray now, Almighty God. Today, we come to You with humble hearts and minds full of worries. We know that many times we try to carry our problems alone, without fully surrendering to You the situations that are beyond our control. But at this moment, 
Father, we choose to trust in your power and wisdom. We know that there is no storm in our lives that you cannot calm. There is no broken situation that you cannot fix. Therefore, we hand over to you each of our struggles and difficulties, trusting that you will bring the solution and the advancement we so desperately need. Lord, you know every area of our lives that is in crisis. For some of us, financial worries have become an overwhelming burden. We don't know where provision will come from, and the bills seem to pile up faster than solutions. But today, we choose to rest in the certainty that you are our provider. We trust that you can multiply the little we have and lead us to experience financial advancement. We ask that while we wait for this breakthrough, you grant us wisdom to manage what we have and peace to avoid despair. Father, we also present to you our broken relationships. We know there are hurts, deep wounds, and perhaps years of resentment that need healing. But just as you restored relationships throughout Scripture, we trust that you can do the same in our lives. We ask for the courage to forgive and the humility to seek reconciliation. May you bring healing where there is pain, and may we see your mighty hand restoring what seemed irreparable. We believe that you can fix what is broken, even in the most difficult and distant relationships. Lord, we recognize that often the storm is not only around us, but also within us. We struggle with fear, anxiety, lack of peace, and even doubt about the future. We ask that you bring calm to our hearts, that your Holy Spirit fill every space of anxiety with your peace that surpasses all understanding. We want to feel your presence within us, trusting that even when everything seems confusing, you are our refuge and strength. Help us to calm the storm within us, so that we can face whatever comes our way with confidence and serenity. Father, Sometimes we feel stuck, as if we cannot move forward in our lives. The doors seem closed, and the path ahead appears blocked. But today, we remember that you are the God who opens doors that no one can shut. We ask that you remove the obstacles in our way and give us the strength to move forward. In your faithfulness, may we experience the progress we have been praying for. We trust that you are already working behind the scenes, preparing the ground for the next step in our lives. We don't want to rely on our own strength, but rather on your guidance and provision. And Lord, above all, we want to express our gratitude. Thank you because, even amidst difficulties, you never abandon us. We are grateful because you guide and sustain us, even when we cannot see the solution. Thank you for already fixing what is broken, even if we have yet to see the results. Thank you for every blessing we have received and for every advancement that is yet to come. We choose to trust in you because we know that you are faithful and just and that your goodness will follow us all the days of our lives. Today, Father, we surrender all our storms into your hands. No matter how impossible the situation seems, we know that you can handle it. We ask that you help us keep our eyes on you and not be overwhelmed by worries. May we walk by faith, trusting that you are in control of every detail and that victory is already being prepared. Thank you, Lord, for your constant presence and unwavering faithfulness. We pray with gratitude and confidence in Jesus' name. Amen. If you were blessed by this prayer, type Amen in the comments below. I declare that all the blessings from this prayer are now upon you, in Jesus' name. You can help us reach more people and spread the gospel by sharing this video with a friend or family member and clicking the like button. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel, Our Father, for more videos that will bless your heart and strengthen your spirit. We deeply appreciate all your support. You are blessed to be a blessing. 
Feel free to leave your prayer requests in the comment section so that we can present them before God, asking for His blessings and victory, and so that other believers on YouTube and around the world can join us in prayer for you. Stand firm in faith with us as we pray. Our team wants to show gratitude to all who have helped sustain our ministry. Your generosity enables us to continue creating and sharing content that strengthens and inspires faith. Repeat after me with great faith. I have the right to be happy. If you believe this statement, write it in the comments with strong faith. To God be all the glory. May the grace and peace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with you all.